I'd like to call to order the meeting of the Village Board for February 22nd, 2022. Can you please join us for the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. <clears throat> Village Clerk, would you please call the roll? President D. Simone? Here. Trustee Carmona? Here. Trustee Fry? Here. Trustee Lomax? Here. Trustee Penicola? Here. Trustee Perez? Here. At six. At this time, we will move the public comment. Does anyone wish to address the board? And if so, please approach the podium and state your name. Any public comment? Are there any online public comments? There's no online public comment. This will conclude public comment. Is there a motion to approve the minutes from the February 8th, 2022 Village Board meeting? You have a motion. Do you have a second. 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 Are there any modifications to the minutes? Please call the roll. Trustee Carmona? Yes. Trustee Fry? Yes. Trustee Lomax? Yes. Trustee Penicola? Yes. Trustee Perez? Yes. That's five. Motion carries and the minutes are approved. The next item of business is to approve the warrant in the amount of $1,112,691.47. Is there a motion to approve the warrant? So moved. Is there a second? Second. Is there any discussion on the warrant? Please call the roll. Trustee Carmona? Yes. Trustee Fry? Yes. Trustee Lomax? Yes. Trustee Penicola? Yes. Trustee Perez? Yes. That's five. Motion carries and the warrant is approved. Will the Deputy Village Clerk please read the 10 ordinances and resolutions on the consent agenda that were discussed at the Committee of the Whole Meeting? Number one, ordinance approving of a site plan review, plat of subdivision, and preliminary and final plan unit development with co departures for the redevelopment of 720, 740, and 840 East Green Street, Bensonville. Two, ordinance approving a plat of consolidation at 904 to 910 West Irving Park Road, Gem Car Wash. Three, ordinance approving a site plan review and final plan unit development with code departures for a 10 unit townhome development at 214 North Walnut Street. Four, resolution authorizing the award of a construction contract for the 2022 water main improvements project to Dudrari Sewer and Water Company Incorporated in a not to exceed amount of $1,421,386.40. Five, resolution authorizing the award of a construction engineering service agreement for the 2022 water main improvements project to Hancock Engineering Company in the not to exceed amount of $126,624. Six, resolution authorizing the award of a construction contract for the Eastern Avenue reconstruction project to R.W. Dutman Company in the not to exceed amount of $1,696,201.24. Seven, resolution authorizing the award of a construction engineering service agreement for the Eastern Avenue reconstruction project to Civil Tech Engineering, Inc. and the not to exceed amount of $168,236. Eight, resolution approving local siting sit requir requir uh, sorry. Resolution approving local siting requests for amber solvent uh, uh, recycling at 1033 Fairway Drive. Nine, resolution authorizing a license agreement between La Huerta and the Village of Bensonville. Ten, resolution approving an intergovernmental agreement between the Village of Bensonville and the Milwaukee District West Community Coalition and authorize the village manager to expand an amount of not to exceed $100,000 to support related legal, technical, public affairs, lobbying, legislative, and all other lawful actions. There are motion to approve the 10 ordinances and resolutions listed on the consent agenda and as read by the deputy clerk. Give a motion. Second. Second. Please call the roll. Trustee Carmona? Yes. Trustee Fry? Yes. Trustee Lomax? Yes. Trustee Penicola? Yes. Trustee Perez? Yes. That's five. Motion carries and the items on the consent agenda are approved. Uh, we do not have any reports for village departments, so we'll move right to presidential remarks. Uh, mark your calendars. The 2022 Law Enforcement Hockey Classic is uh, to benefit Honor Flight Chicago returns to the Edge Ice Arena on Saturday, March 12th, 2022 at 6 p.m. To purchase tickets, please call 773 227-8387 or go to the Village website for more information. The Illinois Department of Public Health, IDPH, is continuing to distribute free rapid COVID-19 self-administered test kits to Bensonville residents. We are encouraging all residents to take advantage of this opportunity. So go to accesscovidtests.org to sign up for free home kit and free delivery. Supplies are limited. One kit per household contains five tests. So please see the Village website for more details. And on a final uh, note, this afternoon I participated in a press conference at the village of Itasca, along with eight other communities along Metro's Milwaukee District West Line from Elgin to Chicago to staunchly oppose the proposed merger of 
uh, Canadian Pacific Railway and the Kansas City Southern Railroad that is pending before the Surface Transportation Board in Washington, D.C. The STOP CPKC CP Coalition has been created, and we intend to collaborate in the fight against this merger. So I thank the Village of Itasca for hosting that. Uh, that concludes my presidential remarks. Do we have a village manager's report? Thank you, Your Honor. I just have a few housekeeping items this evening. ComEd will begin their tree trimming within the village within the next month or so. They'll be trimming trees, branches, and vines that interfere with power lines. This maintenance helps avoid power outers and disruptions. As we all know, ComEd is a little, how do we say, brutal with their tree trimming. So that is not, <laughs> if the tree looks ugly when it's trimmed, that was not the village of Bentsville that did that. That was definitely ComEd. We blame them for everything. <laughs> Uh, and uh, also, just a quick reminder on overnight parking, especially with uh, snow and ice in the forecast, make sure that uh, no cars are parked on the street between 2 a.m. and 6 a.m. any day of the week. If you do need to park overnight, if you have a guest over, call the village and we will do a temporary exemption for that. And finally, the village intends to follow suit with the state and beginning February 28th, remove mass restrictions and make them optional. I think we're all looking forward to that. So February 28th, the end is in sight. Everyone hang in there. <laughs> That concludes my report, Mr. President. Do we have a village attorney report? I have no report, Mr. President. Is there any unfinished business to come before the board tonight? None. Is there new business to come before the board tonight? Seeing none. Is there a need for executive session? There is not a need. Okay. Do I have a motion to adjourn the meeting? Yeah, a motion. Do I have a second? Second. second. Please call the roll. Trustee Carmona? Yes. Trustee Fry? Yes. Trustee Lomax? Yes. Trusty Penicola? Yes. Trusty Perez? Yes. That's fine. Motion carries. We are adjourned. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen.